All right, if you, as you can see on the screen, this is the new Facebook profile hack, which I'm going to show how to do, which you get a consistent image look uh, across your Facebook profile. First thing you're going to do is in the link below um, this video, you're going to download the Photoshop file called Facebook template. Once that's downloaded, mine's here on my desktop. It's going to look like this. You're going to go to your desktop, double click, it's going to bring this up. Um, let me get rid of this, get rid of that. Here's your template. What you're going to do then is you're going to go and uh, pull up the file that you want to use for the picture. Give me a second as I pull up mine. So this was the picture I used um, before. Let me give you an example. Let's try, nah, I think a close up works best. So I'm gonna use this picture of my cat. Go back here, take the picture drag and drop it in Photoshop open this up and now all I'm gonna do is reposition this to make it work um, line it up I'm going to change I'm going to increase the size of this so right now it's as you can see at the top its width is at 19 percent its height is at 19 percent if you need to get your picture to fit in the frame Let's try 25% by 25%. That's a little better. As you can see, all right, you gotta get both of his eyes in there. Then what I'm gonna do is click, hit enter or the return key. It's gonna put those images together. You're gonna go up to, whoa there, too much file I can't see it like that file save for web and devices um, I'm going to use my keypad to move back and forth and now the images that I want to keep um, first off I'm going to go up here and change the file format to JPEG. Put it on the maximum quality, which is going to be 100. Go back over to my picture, click the first box, and then hold down the Shift key. Click the second box, the third, the fourth, the fifth. Scroll over the sixth. I'm going to go down and hit Save. I'm going to save it to my desktop, and I'm going to create a new folder. called Facebook hack create the new folder underneath slices make sure it has all user slices selected hit save now you're gonna go into your Facebook profile and upload the pictures I guess let me see oh I have to do this again I like the way his eyes are lined up I don't want to do it again and mess up the picture I already have in here. So I'm going to give you a verbal. So um, go to your profile, click photos, hit upload photos. And then create the album. Uh oh. Yeah. Select the photos from the file on the desktop, which we called Facebook Hack or. or yeah, and then images, and you're going to see six images, one long and five uh, smaller ones. So you're going to upload those. Once they're uploaded, um, let me see if I can pull it up. Mm. Basically, when the, the picture's upload and they're already saved, you're going to hit back to album, and it's going to bring you up to a page that looks just like this. 
and you're going to have to tag these in reverse order. So you're going to go to your last picture, you're going to tag it, hit previous, tag, previous tag, previous tag this, previous tag this, and then the last one, the long one, you're going to click at the bottom, make profile picture. Once that's done, go back to your profile, and there you have it.